Hi, this is Meenakshi here and I'm here to talk something exciting about art and architecture. To create one's world in the field of art requires great courage and challenge. And I'm here with a person who has got a great interest in the field of art and adds a pleasing essence in his lenses and frame through his photography. Hemant Mishra, a photographer who has been clean and experimental since childhood, hailing from the city of Lucknow, is as saw and elegant as he looks. Having a profound interest in the field of photography, he has ascended himself to envision our country's glory and pride through his series of exhibition, Incredible India. I'm amused by this work. I'm definitely not here to photograph them, but to feel the liveliness of this place, to bring them through my lenses to showcase to the world. In this series, I'm showcasing the pictures from Hampi, Mahabalipuram, Lepakshi, and also from Jaisalmer. Lepakshi, as pretty as its name, is tucked in the district of Anandpur in Andhra Pradesh. It is believed that during the mythological period of Ramayana, the bird Chetayu had fallen down here and had wounded himself and hence the name Le Pakshi which means rice bird. The main attraction of this place is the monolithic Nandi and the Virabhadra Swami temple. Around 350 kilometers away from Bangalore is this small and trivial village of Hampi Nagara. It has scenic and serene surroundings with the main attractions like the Lotus Mahal, the Queen's Bath, the Stone Chariot of the Vithala Temple, the Krishna Bazaar, the Rishimukh Parvat and many more to go on. Hampi speak of its own age and heritage with its time. It is believed that it was built during the reign of Krishnadevaraya and has obvious Vijayanagara style of architecture. And now let's talk about the striking architecture of Mahabalipuram. Mahabalipuram or Mamalapuram is as powerful as its name. It was named after the demon king Mahabali who was killed by Lord Krishna. One who visits this place will get startled and intoxicated with its grandeur. Well, I would feel in short of words to describe the beauty of these compelling monuments. But you will be able to see how beautifully these images have been shot, portrayed and has been brought into your eyes through his frame and lenses that is photography. Our sculptors are real magician who have carved such beautiful sculptures without no modern era and technique. There is something happening and fascinating in all the images he has shot. With this, this is Minakshi signing off from you and thank you so much for watching this video.